Things are looking good from where I sit in the United States of who gives a shit. Sucking off from whatever I can, cash in Satan's check with my dick in my hands. So, it's not 420 right now, but I think it's time for some cannibalists! Flash Rock.
slingshot from your tongue now spinning like a boomerang. I mean, you heard it. I was here. I experienced it. Cannibalists. Oh yeah, yeah guys. Yeah. Cheers, man. Yeah. It's, I'm, I, I, I've got like two things I want to say to you, and I can wrap it all up in one sentence. Thanks a lot. Thank right. you. Thank, Thank you, man. I mean, yeah, thanks a lot time. because I, I, you know, it's it's like right when a band comes in here, and I'm like, I can feel it. It's like I'm not in there doing what I'm doing in there. I'm like, I'm actually like in this area with you guys. It was it was incredible. Just the intensity and the. Just the energy you brought to be able to bridge the gap between listener and, and the band. Yeah, we, when we were coming over here, man, it was like we got off the freeway and Fine. we're like, where the fuck are we going, man? <laughs> I think we're like, these guys are setting us up, bro. I think we're going <laughs> to Okay, we got to start talking about <laughs> the bands before they show up. Look for the pseudo crack house. You know, <laughs> it's like, you know, and then like, you know, we go by, it's, it's like that, you know, I mean, this is like bigger than it. You look outside and it's like a... Like my my fucking mansion in the box out in the alley at my house, <laughs> you know. But I come in here and it's like fucking Alice in Wonderland and shit, bro. You know, fucking the shit's like wide open and it goes all the way in the fucking back, you know. Nice. But uh, yeah, we come in here and we're like, oh shit, man. I don't know. I mean, it's it's been a, a kind of funky month where, you know, kind of crazy shit's been happening, but. Well, yeah, that's never gonna life. be. That's never was gonna be expected, today. you know. <laughs> well, to but, the throngs of fans you just earned right now, introduce yourselves. What's uh, up, everybody? We're Cannibalists. Uh, 
We're a Southern California band from San Diego, rocking out with the boys here from Flash Rock. It's been a wonderful opportunity to be able to do this. This is something that uh, it's few and far between. As far as I know, this is probably one of the very few setups of its kind, and it's a privilege to be here. Hell yeah! I need yeah. more. To, need to more action. More people. Wow. Like, need more people like you to do that, man. I mean, to help out not only just like local bands from. I mean, you guys are just helping out from us down to San Diego and stuff. You know. And uh, it's, it's great, you know what I mean? It gets it gets our music out there. It gets all of everybody's mu- music out there. And and uh, it, it's, it's awesome, man. Well, there Sick. used to be something really cool called a community within the music scene. <laughs> yeah. Um, Still yeah. exists here and there. Yeah. Exactly, you know, I mean, you know, you, you, can't, you can't sit on your ass and bitch about how fucked up the scene is unless you try to do something about it. And I, I hope, and apparently so, at least you guys are enjoying it. You know, we're trying to... Yeah, we are, man. If there were no you, there would be no us, is basically what I got to say to that one. Hell yeah, thank you. Thank you. So, hell yeah. Where can we find you guys on the websites? Uh, we actually we just launched our new website uh, cannibalis onecom c a n o b l i s s one dot com. So check it out. That is our new official homepage for Cannibalis. You can also find us Facebook, uh, MySpace if that still exists, Twitter, you know, YouTube, all that good stuff. All and you can, uh, you can find spots. me at my house at eight four seven. Hold on, before you go, ladies only. Let me just say, ladies only. People have done that. You know, we're regretting it. <laughs> we're on, uh, we're on Reverb Nation. You know. We're on Twitter. We're, we're all over the place. Any, any major social network page that's out there right now, Cannibalis is on there. So iTunes, whatever, whatever. CD baby. Yeah, whatever floats Perfect. your boat, you know, we're we're more than likely dialed into it. So make sure make sure you try to hit us up whichever way that you can. Uh, we've got a uh, we've got a Southwest tour coming up uh, in July, July twenty second through August August sixth. August sixth. Hitting up Arizona, New Mexico, Texas, and Oklahoma. We're expecting this to Oklahoma, be Oklahoma, baby. Yeah, this is we're expecting it's where this the to tornadoes be. happen. <laughs> hey, it's Tornado Alley, baby. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I used to live there. Yeah, let's see one. Now, albums, I, I, I gotta ask, how many albums are there, um, or is there just one right now, or what's the deal with that? Cannibalist has been around for, for, for a while now, there's, a, there's five CDs, five albums total that the, that the band has put, to go, put together over the years. Oh, I got some catching up to um, do. These, this this uh, lineup has been together for the last three albums, okay. and we're currently working on our fourth one, yeah. Yeah. so and that uh, we're hoping to get that put together by sometime early next year, hopefully by spring next year we'll have that. Uh, Very cool. earlier than that, maybe even earlier than that but as far as uh, <laughs> music for that new album already exists it's already being written and worked on and it's just a matter of uh, you know getting in there get, doing getting it. it in there getting in there and getting it done I mean we've always been uh, I don't know I don't know how the hell it is that we managed to get stuff done <laughs> because we, uh, sometimes sometimes we do things in, kind of in a rush and uh, it tends it, 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 it always ends, always works out you know in the end but um this this album, I think we're really gonna try to take our time with it and focus focus on on the music and and be really involved as a band together with it and stuff and hopefully um, we've even outsourced a little bit and you know we're we're reaching out to we're trying to reach out to people that we want to work with. Uh, there's a producer that we're tentatively gonna be working with uh, uh, because we've always felt sometimes in the, we're in the studio and we're just kind of fighting each other. On basically on uh, phenomenal ideas, but we just can't decide on which idea it is. It's too and, personal. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Three, three of us will like something and one of us won't. Then we need to start debating: is it good or is it not good? It's, it's it can get counterproductive sometimes. Right. So, so it's, we just need that outside ear to kind of come in and tell us what's. Hey, the Beatles' <laughs> best shit was when George Martin came in. Yeah, you can uh, you, you can do a lot on your own, but you can't do everything on your own. Absolutely. It, it's it, just your job to play and have fun. Yeah, it's 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 hard to think <laughs> outside that's of the all box. Was, eh? It's definitely hard to think outside of the box when you're an independent band. You don't have a label, you know, making all those decisions for you. So when you're independent, it's just like it's that uh, that risk that you got to take uh, when you you know when you finish a song. Is is this song done? I mean, we think it's done. It sounds cool to us, but it might not sound good, cool to everybody else. So it's just that you know that uh, that uh, eternal battle. You yeah, know, as long as you don't go overboard like George Lucas and Steven Spielberg, then it's yeah. all good, man. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. absolutely. So, <laughs> bring uh, back the old albums, but cut out the cuss words. Right? Yeah, right, yeah, you know. Okay. <laughs> now you're messing with the son of a... <laughs> Anyways, I gotta say, your music, it sounds technical as hell, but I'm kind of getting a vibe from you guys, and this is where you guys... This is my infamous backhanded compliment. I'm getting the feeling if I learned this stuff, I'd be like, oh my god, this shit is just so rudimentary and easy. In the sense of, like, tool. 
Like you listen to Tool and it's like, right. what the fuck are right. they doing? And then you like kind of break some of this stuff down. It's like, oh, it's just wow, it's just like really <laughs> basic, like good groove and shit. Yeah. yeah, we've always been a band that we, 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 we've said it a lot and we continue to say, we just like to write good sounding music. Um, we're not we don't go into it yeah some, of course sometimes you know when you're writing when you're writing all your material and we are we, we like to consider ourselves a metal band um, although some people consider us to be a hard rock band whatever it is we sometimes we go into it with an idea it's like oh we need to write a hard song but it's not something that you know is present there throughout the whole process it's like we just let the, the songs naturally come out see how they all sound and uh, you know sonically it's like we need to throw something a little heavier in there so then from that perspective we might you know intentionally go well, into the heavy, studio heavy start. doesn't mean technical either though exactly I mean, we have there's definitely some technical race but we don't go out of our way to make it difficult to play well i'm talking i'm, I'm speaking theater. from a uh, from a uh, style from stylistically you yeah. know not, not not you know very cool uh, technically any last words you want to get out to the fans or just anybody in general any shout outs any uh, anybody you want to promote uh, we want to say what's up to the San Diego crew, all of our yeah. Cano freaks out from San Diego. Fucking Thanks. phenomenal. Well, uh, all the people out from Texas. All the people uh, from Texas. New Mexico. Albuquerque, Arizona. what's up? El Paso, what's okay. up? Our boys, Ekin is dead. I think they're, they're the ones that told us about you guys. So oh, you got people the, from Albuquerque that'll be probably watching this? Oh, yeah. 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 Hey, if like you know it. me, what's up, man? Burt's TV on July 23rd. July 23rd. See you on the 23rd, Albuquerque. Um... You know, Texas has embraced us. Um, you know, uh, like like we said, you know, we're, we're an independent band, and you know, the way the economy is right now, we just can't drop everything that we're doing, you know, and just leave on a whim. You know, like we have to plan everything out, and it's feasible for us to to travel out to to Texas right now, and that's what we're doing. We're you know, we're doing what we can to get out, you know, of San Diego to get out you of got SoCal, just California in general. And play to other crowds, and it's this it's it's universe. awesome, man. Because you head out to the <laughs> you, head, you head out to the middle of the country, you head out to the southwest, you head out to the Midwest, and there's just towns out there that they're just starving kids for good are, music. Kids, yeah, kids need just, to fucking rebel as well, mm -hmm. you know. And music is the best outlet, I think. Really, uh, music is what kind of starts the mind rolling and gets the individual thinking about what's truly right and what's truly wrong. And without without the balladeers of our generation, we'd be a bunch of fucking monkeys throwing shit at each other, in my opinion. <laughs> yeah, well, we kind of still do that, do that yeah. anyways, but... Uh, it is fun. <laughs> that's oh, another but, story, because we ain't the one to gossip. <laughs> Before we forget, we want to send a special shout-out to uh, our, our, our number one street team member out in Denmark. Denmark? Oh, yeah, Christian. Christian. Uh, thank you, Christian. He, uh, he named our Southwest Tour, Survival of the Sick, is 2011. Yeah. So thank you to Christian, our number one street team member, all, all the way nice. out there in Denmark. So cool guy. Well, it definitely looks like you guys are on your way to actually doing something worthwhile. We're trying. <laughs> Five albums now, um, the lineup for the last three. Definitely rocking stuff. I'm really glad you guys finally made it in. I know this was scheduled a while ago. Yes. Um, but, you know, good things come to those who wait. Yes, sir. Wow, why am I so fucking positive tonight? <laughs> <laughs> By the way, my intro Because this, you were a badass, hey. that's why, man. <laughs> uh, wait a minute, I want to bring this guy in here because uh, he's, he's, he's got See, some... See, you Russian, get in, come on. He's get got in, some Russian on. things that he wants to he's say real quick. Until you have been here for too long. He's like, oh, oh, fuck <laughs> <it>. <laughs> Thanks for coming. <laughs> this, guy, this guy is great, man. <laughs> yeah. tell, tell some he's tell been some to our fans right now, man. You fuckers, if you don't know these fuckers, it's time. You are, was you are wasting your time on porn. Like this. <laughs> oh, by the way, speaking of porn, I just wanted to make Can a you quick really point. It's not flesh cock. Can you no, no, it's not flesh cock. <laughs> like when you watch porn, who watches the H who, who clicks on the HD button when they're in the middle of watching a porno? It's very really important. I think you got to pay to get the HD That's what I'm saying. Who fucking clicks on the HD button? I'm busy. I need to get my shit off quick. It's very much I'm having a hard time switching hands to get to the mouse to click the <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is boring. <laughs> well, well, you brought it up. Apparently, I am capable of it's doing like a somewhat <laughs> comprehensive, <laughs> comprehensive interview that's not a bunch of potty talk like I'm famous for. But again, uh, if a band knows how to promote themselves, all I got to do here is sit here. <laughs> you, know, you guys are great, man. Obviously, hey, this thank you, brother. First. Thank you. You clean up your own mess. I would, I would implore you, please, if you could get us some copies or some tracks that we can put on our playlist for the yeah, Monday Night Radio Show. Show. I would love to fucking start pumping you on a regular Thank rotation. You. Thank you. Thank you. You know, it's nice called it's called a bro job. So, <laughs> so long as it's not a bro yeah. mince. Exactly. Hey, we can do a Dutch thing though. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Five should have said her name. Have you ever heard of the Dutch Rudder? Let's go to the Dutch. We can all do a Dutch Rudder here. It'll be a great. Anybody seen Zach and Mira make a porno? Alright. I'm a fucking guy. And I've just been smoked by animals. It wasn't here. It wasn't on this earth. I went somewhere else. And it was just total peace and joy.